This would completely change your boat. There's no drag. There's virtually no cavitation. Yeah, I know. I wanted to do something similar. But everyone told me structural stability was more important. That doesn't apply here. Why? Because this eliminates direct stress on the keel. It's basic. Are you serious? <laughs> Anyways. Is that my boat? Yeah. You drew my boat. Yeah. Good luck with the race, and um, be careful out there. Thank you. We're up here with Amanda Chu, and um, first of all, great movie. I really enjoyed it. Thanks. Now. Now tell me the story. Now it's your birthday, you get a call, you, you have a cast in and you're reading across from Zac Efron. How lucky are you? Yeah, I, uh, what a great birthday present. I, <laughs> I, uh, yeah, the call was that I was gonna be reading, like I'd already auditioned, but that I was gonna be screen testing with him and uh, you know, just to be considered to, for the role was an honor. So then when I actually got it, that was, uh, that was a big moment for me. <laughs> okay. Now the story was originally set on the East Coast, but it was shot in your home, in your backyard in yeah. Columbia. Yeah, yeah, was shot up in Vancouver, which was awesome because Vancouver in the summer is amazing. It's kind of similar to this, and uh, and yeah, so that was awesome to be back home, and you know, it's such an or outdoorsy city, and then you know, just get to show everyone else around. Right, Vancouver. Right, right. Can I have that sketch someday? Yours now. Thanks. So I haven't shown you my roots. Oh. You're limping. Yeah, I told you. I got tossed around pretty good in my lasso. So I'm starting in Boston, and then I'm gonna make my way south towards Brazil. And and then I'm gonna go um, through the... Your character in the movie, Tess, is, is trying to be the youngest skipper to do this contest to go across the world. Yeah. I know that there's been, you know, a lot of heroin stories of people making it across the world, and there's been recent stories of teenagers like Ashley Sutherland, who yes. is 16 years old, trying to make it across the world. Do you have any sailing experience, and is this something that you ever, you um, know, sought Previous out to, to this do? movie, I had no sailing experience, and, uh, you know, but we did a lot of training for it, a lot of sailing training and, you know, gym workouts, and, uh, and so, but, I mean, when I heard I was sailing, I pictured myself in a bikini with, like, a <laughs> martini or something, uh, which is not the case. Sailing right, right. is, uh, as I, I found out, is a very um, hard and, um, you know, physically demanding sport, sport right. um, and I'm a klutz too so I fell a lot but it was a lot of fun you know but it was terrifying at first but you kind of get the hang of it and uh, you know we had coaches and everything so right right Zach was definitely better than me though oh, okay. okay yeah sure the fans would love that <laughs> <laughs> now the story does deal with um, with loss and and how people kind of get paralyzed sometimes when trying to deal with loss you yeah know? Is, uh, do you think a lot of people be able to relate to that in the story and see like, you know, some of their own uh, maybe tragedies that they dealt with? I think so. And, and, you know, not even just with loss with, you know, with, um, you know, people in our lives, but just loss of, I mean, I think everyone can relate to loss in their right. life and just holding on to the past and how that can, um, you know, we, we hold on to things in the past and it kind of can hold us back in life. Right. And if you hold on to all this stuff, it really anchors you, anchors. <laughs> <laughs> um, and you know you can't fully live your life. So um, so it's 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 kind of a great lesson in like letting go of the past and living in the moment. Okay, okay. And lastly, like what what was some of the the, the funner moments on set with you and Zach? Because I know you had a lot of screen time. Yeah, I mean on. just I mean we got to hang out a lot. The the whole cast and crew we became really really close and just kind of you know, 
we would always just kind of do fun things on the weekend. We'd go up to Whistler and like hang out up, which is a mountain up there. And so we'd hang out up there and just, you know, just goof around, have dance parties. I mean, we, everyone, it was just really cool. And we just always had a good time no matter what we were doing. All right, well, thank you for your time. Yeah. And uh, everybody- Do you want me to go? No. Then why did you bring her? I didn't mean to spy on you. Charlie, it's okay. I can't lose Sam, Tess. I can't lose Sam. Let's go. No. Let's go. The more I'm in your world, the less I can be in his. Charlie, at some point, we all have to let go. I can't lose Sam, Tess. Bye, Tess. Follow us. Follow us now. Try to run.